Welcome back to part three of the five-part webinar on authentic assessment. This segment will focus on the satire, the scale for the assessment of teachers' impressions of routines and engagement. In this section, you will have the opportunity to review the satire and focus on your role as an interviewer. In order to participate in this section, please print out the satire document and the note-taking page. Although this portion can be done independently, you will have a much richer understanding if you complete this segment in collaboration with other providers. By the end of this section, you will have the opportunity to review the satire and reflect on its use as compared to your current practice. You will have the opportunity to see an example of the satire and reflect on how you can use this in the context of your work with young children, their families, and their classroom teachers. The RBI, the Safer, and the Everyday Routine section on the IFSP are the three ways Part C providers in Maryland can gather information for the family assessment. Each of these practices support having conversations with the people that spend the most time with the child. If a child spends more than 16 hours in a child care setting, it is recommended that an interviewer be completed with the care provider. In that case, the satire can be used. The satire is for professionals in preschool programs and child care centers who work with teachers and families to develop functional intervention plans. The satire is the companion to the SAFER and RBI and is designed to be used in conjunction with the routines-based interview of the family. By gathering information about how the child functions during classroom routines, in addition to information from the family about home and community routines, professionals and families can develop a complete picture of a child's abilities and needs, from which to make informed decisions about interventions. The goals and outcomes generated from this assessment are functional, in that they immediately address useful skills that the child needs to perform throughout the day, and they are transdisciplinary, resulting in multiple professionals being able to address them. Let's take a look at the satire. If you have not already done so, pause the webinar and print a copy of the satire for your review. This activity will take about 15 minutes to complete. Read page one of the satire and reflect on the directions presented. Review the document by looking at the routines identified by Dr. McWilliam. Choose one routine that you want to explore in depth. As you review the routine, record your thoughts to the following questions and be prepared to share with your colleagues. What are your initial thoughts as you look at this routine activity? How do you currently gather this information from the caregivers? How could you use the satire to enhance your current interview practices? Typically, the interview with the teacher happens prior to a discussion with the caregiver. This allows the interviewer to confirm with the caregiver information from the classroom teacher. Prior to the discussion with the teacher, the interviewer reviews the purpose of the meeting, saying something like this. The purpose of today's meeting is to go through your day-to-day -day activities of your classroom to find out how the child is participating throughout the day. At the end, we'll have a list of items that you would like the team to work on. We will go through as many activities as time allows. I will be asking a lot of questions around the child's engagement, independence, and social relationships. I will also explore how well the activities are working for the child, which I will refer to as the goodness of fit. Do you have any questions before we get started? A satire discussion with the lead teacher can last up to two hours. The interviewer should explore at least three routines of the classroom. However, it would be best to get as many as time allows. It is important to get an idea of how the child is doing in comparison with the peers in the classroom. This helps to understand the goodness of fit. There are guiding questions on the document, as well as typical times of day in a preschool classroom or childcare setting. However, it is important to explore unique times for this child and teacher. This recap happens after both the family and the teacher have participated in an interview. It is typical to schedule a meeting with the parents present to hold a joint discussion. The interviewer reviews the concerns mentioned in both the home routines portion of the RBI or SAFER and the classroom routines portion of the satire to remind everyone what has been discussed. This also gives the family and the teacher the opportunity to clarify concerns. The family then chooses their priorities, which will become the outcomes or goals. If the routines for which a priority is needed are not clear, the family is asked for what times of the day or activities this priority would be important. This is especially relevant when families talk about something that had not been mentioned earlier during the interview or they refer to a specific treatment or service. This next activity allows you the opportunity to see several routine activities discussed with the teacher in a preschool special education classroom. 
As you watch, write down your thoughts on the note-taking form. What questions asked provided a great deal of information about the child, the teacher, and the classroom activities? What questions were missed? In other words, what questions would you have asked during this discussion? Since much of this interview is dependent on personal style, what were nonverbal behaviors that contributed to the discussion? And what nonverbal behaviors took away from the discussion? There are five video clips for you to review. For this activity, choose at least one, but as many as you would like, to review. Enjoy discovering Henderson and his amazing classroom teacher. Checklist training is considered the best way to learn a new skill. You have a copy of the Satire Fidelity Checklist, a tool developed with the support of Dr. Robin McWilliam. This checklist can be used to help learn a practice, ensure consistency of the practice, and provide continuity across all providers. The checklist addresses aspects of the practice to ensure each family and child care provider is afforded a quality conversation about their activities that will result in functional and meaningful information to support interventions. Now that you have seen daily activities reviewed using a satire, consider this strategy. Many times when children are struggling with a routine, the initial focus is to identify the skills the child needs to learn to meet with success. How can the information from the satire help a classroom teacher explore each of these strategies in order to create a culture that supports each child's participation in classroom activities? You have now reached the end of part three of this webinar. Part four will focus on strategies to support asking questions to acquire robust information across engagement, independence, and social relationships using both the safer and the satire. You will also gain insight to 10 indicators of a quality interview.